Pokemon Detective Pikachu stars Justice Smith as Tim Goodman, who goes on this journey to find his missing father, who was a detective in Rhyme City. And so Tim travels all the way to Rhyme City, and along the way, finds this talking Pikachu, voiced by Ryan Reynolds. Or at least only Tim can understand him. Throughout the movie, as the title suggests, they do detective stuff. You know, they try to find this missing detective, as well as find out the reason behind why they can understand each other. When I first heard about this movie, especially Ryan Reynolds voicing Pikachu, I wasn't particularly fond of this idea. Live action video game films haven't particularly done well in the past. It just didn't really seem right, you know? Like, I kind of grew up with Pokemon. I, I used to play the video games and the card games, and I also watched some of the show. So I kind of expect Pikachu to have his iconic Pika Pika voice, not a voice from a grown man in his 40s. So I didn't really understand why they chose Ryan Reynolds to voice him in this film. But now, after having watched all of the movie, I can see two great reasons why. One of them I can't really get into because it is a major spoiler. I love that part by the way. Those of you who have seen the film probably know what I mean. But another reason why was because he is so goddamn funny. I love Ryan Reynolds' work and he makes this movie awesome. He was definitely the star of this film. You know, if there was no him, this movie just wouldn't be interesting at all. He brings his own wit to the table and shows a humorous side to Pikachu that we've never really seen before. And thank God for that because, in, to be honest, all of the characters in this movie, apart from the Pokemon, were all really bland and boring. Justice Smith was okay, he did fine, and the chemistry between him and Reynolds was great to see, but everyone else just had no substance to their character. The Pokemon were great, it actually gave me goosebumps seeing them in action. The CGI was really top notch, and the action was really entertaining. I just wish we saw more Pokemon battles and catching Pokemon, because this movie felt really story oriented. The kind of action in this movie had me craving for more. But the main issue with this movie that I had was the story. Not that it was particularly bad, I kind of liked it, it was fine, it was decent, like, it wasn't perfect by a long shot, but it was okay. It's just that some parts of this movie had a lot of storytelling and it wasn't really any interesting storytelling either. It just felt really forced and they had to do a lot through flashbacks and it felt like they had to do that to keep the story going, keep the momentum going and kind of develop the story's arc. But they kind of make up for that by making the action scenes look really good. The ending almost made me tear up because it was just so sudden, so in your face and I didn't really know how to respond to it. Now I don't want to spoil the movie by saying that a certain thing happened or I felt a certain way, but I just want to say that the last 20 minutes of this movie really surprised me, but in a really good way. All in all, this movie was really entertaining and it had a lot of stuff in it that was out of the ordinary. Stuff that I didn't really expect and I need more movies like this that make me feel this way. Although I wish we got like some cameos from the show, for example Team Rocket, like I would have loved to see Jesse and James in there just for the heck of it. I thought I saw Jesse in there, but it turned out it wasn't her, but oh well. Either way, this live action film worked. This live action video game film worked. I, I can't really say the same for the upcoming Sonic movie though. <sighs> oh my god, why? That movie just feels like a recipe for disaster. I mean, why couldn't they just have made that, like, the movie within the Sonic the Hedgehog universe instead of some fuck, like, really crappy live action? I'm going to rate Detective Pikachu an A minus. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Have you seen Detective Pikachu? What did you think about it? Please leave a comment about your thoughts below. Like the video if you liked it, and drop a sub to help the channel out. Also, feel free to check out my previous video. Until next time.